And how do you get these youth to open up to you and to trust you and to share their most shameful, like terrifying moments? Yeah. So my, I'm on kind of a push this year um, of really helping kids to be able to feel safe to share this and not feel like it's their shame to bear. Because like you said, I think that's exactly what happens. Children bear the shame for what is really not theirs to bear. It is really the shame of the person who thought it was okay to do this to a child. But because children bear, sort of hold on to that shame, they feel like they can't share that. So we're really, at Reclaim 13, we're really always trying to think of how we can make this more of a, a normative conversation that we can have with one another and we can share. We have a lot of survivors on staff and so we really believe it's important to kind of put that out there and to be able to say, look, as examples, that you, this is something that you went through, but it does not have to define you. You can reclaim, we call them reclaimers. You can reclaim your life. Your identity is not in your victimization. Your, your identity is in the, the beautiful story that's going to come out of that. And we have so many stories of that um, to be able to tell that that's kind of our goal that this year so that, so that kids can know that this is not the end of the story.